Let's go, boy. This way. Let's go. Come on. This way. Go hot, eh? I'll put the officers on your floor. Get them. Prosecutors called it a brutal and senseless attack. It shattered a family and it sent a young man to prison for what amounts to the rest of his life. Many in the community are outraged at this senseless attack and can't understand why a young man would commit such a brutal act. saying this goes to show that there is no hope for this generation. That our teens are all together lost, while others say there has to be more behind this ruthless attack. Tell me, from you a little boy, your mother was in an abusive relationship like that and chose to stay there? Yeah. Why? But I could only imagine the effect it had on you, emotionally and psychologically scarred for life. Yeah, but I just wish, I just wish it had stopped there. So there's more? <sighs> wow. Bride, you up? Not really, why? Are you hungry? Yeah, I do, but you know I ain't nothing else in this house to eat. You won't got no more crackers? We going for breakfast. I just was thinking, how I want to get out of this house, or this lifestyle. I want to go to college and be a lawyer. Me too, all I want to do is own my own business. Hey, one of these days. Shh, shh, come look how you come in. Come on, yeah. Bye. to his own kids. The man that's supposed to love and protect you your whole life. A father. How can a father do that to his own kids? And where is your mother in all of this? She just stood by and allowed it to happen? So you're sitting there telling me there's nobody, absolutely nobody you guys can talk to. I mean, we, we tried. We tried to tell someone. My sister, she tried. My mom stopped her. She pretended like it didn't happen. And you sitting there telling me that there's a God out there who loves me as a plan of birth for my life, that I'm precious. Precious. Precious! Precious! We ain't precious! Because if he was precious, he wouldn't let that to me and my sister! What kind of God that is? What kind of God that is? What kind of God that is? Love today. God wants you to know that you're not trash. 
but your treasure. Some of you have been raped. Some of you have been beaten. Some of you have been mentally and physically abused. And you feel worthless. Some of you have been through some of the hardest things life could bring your way. But God says this one is for precious. Some of you, the church, have overlooked you all of your life. They did a good job at judging you. But they didn't know the context. They just saw the content. But God says, I know the content today. And that I won't judge you for where you are. Because I know where you're going. Brian, I don't know what I'm going to do. What you mean you don't know what you have to do? You know you have to tell mommy, right? How we can tell mommy this? Boy, I know you can tell her, but you have to tell her. Brian, I'm scared. I'm really, I'm really scared. I know you're scared, but it's going to be okay. Trust me, it's going to be okay, sis. Don't worry about it. about God is he can make every wrong decision right God How? still loves you How? because that's just the way he is <laughs> he loves you in spite of your situation in spite of your circumstance <laughs> he's always right there <laughs> how could he love me and how could he know me how could one be so awesome ever care so much for me? And how could he love man enough to redeem man? How could he sacrifice? His only son to set me free. 
That's just the way the Father is. He'll be your friend when you're not here. That's just his way. That's just the way he is. He's nothing like your other friends. He'll be with you until the end. That's just his way. That's just the way he is. He this one is for precious. This one is for precious that's in this building today. You see, precious God didn't forget you. 